understand mm-hmm. where Lady J coming from, your your tips and customer service and shit, motherfuckers you work with too. So yeah, I definitely understand. Mm-hmm. But you, uh, well, you can slap a bitch and open a room. You can't get fired. So you feel like you feel your like slapping face. a bitch, and I feel like hitting them up. <laughs> I know that's I bad. I feel like hitting them up today. That's, uh, that's like that movie was Smoking Aces. That's why I own Smoking Aces right there. But anyway, hey, what's, what we got next? <laughs> we got who we got next? We got main man. Ooh, yeah, y'all, we lost our spot. Give us a second. You know, I'm normally organized, so y'all can't hold this against me. I'll chase money, man of a young nigga. Okay, let's see what, what he on. Police are investigating a homicide near 29th and Cherry. Police say two men were shot while inside their vehicle. One of the victims died. The other is being treated at the hospital. Streets in the area are back open. New from overnight, a crime Freaky spree in Wisconsin and several arrests in Illinois. It all started with a string of shootings in Rock County. Then Elliot did a break from news desk with the tail. Yes. Good morning, Melinda and Patrick. Five people are in custody this morning after a search that involved law enforcement agencies from all across the region. The suspects are accused of being involved with three shootings in Beloit. That's just south of Janesville. Police say they responded to these three incidents on Thursday evening. Shots were fired at a vehicle. Ah. Today, though. <laughs> oh, these young niggas today was crazy. Fucked up. 
Man, so you had a story, right. I have a story. So I was at the laundromat yesterday, chilling, sitting in the car, waiting for the clothes like every black person do. Uh, in a Mexican neighborhood, nonetheless. And um, when you see four young black boys walk into the facility with no bags and no adults, you can't help but to wonder. So I didn't want to stereotype, but instantly I was like, look at these little niggas. I'm like, what they on? So I'm just, I'm sitting in the car peeping it, and then next thing I know, we get word that they done robbed, some, robbed somebody and ran off. So, uh, yeah, they, they definitely out here. And I, I, looking at them, they couldn't be no more than 16. And I'm like, what the hell? Four of them. Deep. So, yeah, they out here. Hey. Yeah, Chicago is, is what Chicago is. But at least it wasn't no guns or nothing. I guess it wasn't no guns. I don't know. But they show was on that. They show on that. So these young niggas crazy nowadays. Did, did they did they have dreadlocks and skinny jeans with the with the That's what they some, some of them had up? dreadlocks. They all had white tees though. <laughs> you gotta look for white, the black white tees, the white tees. Yeah, mm-hmm. you know. What was their tips? Was they yeah, blind? Some, <laughs> you so funny because those are the ones that's retired. <laughs> Family, yeah, man. it was too niggas, tall. Man. <laughs> yeah, man, these little Hell niggas, yeah. man. Like we was, we we was on some shit when we was shorties, man. No doubt, you know what I'm saying. We weren't perfect, but these little niggas, man, it's like an epidemic of that shit. I like, mean, I, 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 I've heard right of you know people. I'm not saying that young at boys never robbed before, but I mean they they came in that on that for sure, and they scoped out the place and they waited until she left and then robbed her, so it was just like very orchestrated. It's crazy, but I felt I felt bad at first because I was stereotyping them the moment they walked up in there, but I mean what what else can you say? They didn't have no, no clothes to wash, so why are you going up in there? And I'm like, so you know, it is what it is. I hate for somebody to stereotype my kids because of how they look, but uh, yes, it, it, it turned it, out rough, they were what they in were. High school right now. It's rough. Like I hate to be in high school in this era right here, man. Like that's oh, some crazy yeah. shit, man. Like right now in this era, yeah, you're on that bus, man. Fighting man. forever. <laughs> man, shit, fuck fighting, fighting them niggas, shooting shit, them niggas. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Shit. True. They used true. To be, they used to be fighting true. back when we was in school. Shit, them niggas ain't fighting. Them niggas are shooting. <laughs> shit. Yeah. One one little one little argument right. in the mushroom turned into death, nigga. <laughs> just That's a little crazy. argument over over a nigga uh, you know, he took my fucking uh bag of Cheetos with the Nothing. With the it, it don't and... even have to be nothing. <laughs> Motherfucker just look look wrong and you gone. So it is what really? it is. But yeah, we definitely feeling that science today. He definitely speaking on some topics we can we can relate to. Yeah, man, it's rough on it. Real talk. Keep it going. Yeah. Got, oh, we got my nigga Blazo back we in gotta, Yeah, we got to throw Blazo back in there again, of course. We're cool, cool. Let's get cool, it, Blazo. Cool. For Coco Pops. Ooh, DJ Solo Dolo. Yeah. yeah. DJ Such and Such. It's a dog, DJ Shotty. Yeah, man, it's all about cool running, 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 See, being broke is not an option. That's why we set the bar high for you niggas. All I want is a couple of damn presidents. <laughs> yeah. Blaze I don't think they hear you, nigga. Run this shit back. In L A one. This tag over here. Okay, okay. It's your boy DJ Solo Dolo. A one five six zero eight. Stand up. This that Puerto Rican Randall Street shit. Ha. Yeah. All I ever wanted is a motherfucking knot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. Made my 
first night on the zip. Seen my first break as a kid, I was traumatized. Yeah. I was legally blind, only thing in my eyes I could see was them dollar signs. If we don't do business, then you ain't my business, cause my only interest is mine and mine. Like the sunrise, I was bound to shine. My mind like so dances, I gotta grind. All I ever wanted was a knife. All I ever wanted was some twice. Most of my niggas wanted by the cops. Made the best move with the cars that we got. Had to learn to get it by the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I die before I ever take the stand. Yeah, yeah. I was told if you was broke, you ain't a man. Yeah, yeah. So like I had time, so I need bands. All yeah. I ever wanted was a knife to my rubber band pop. All I ever wanted was a knife to my rubber band pop. All I ever wanted was a knife my rubber band pop. All I ever wanted was a knife to my rubber band pop. For that bread I go. For that sack I go For that cheese I go For that fatty go Look. Went from the brakes to the trash My pussy rape went through the roof My girl that boy don't take that shit to the head Please, all that shit huh? Ain't nothing new Used to be green, now my hundreds is blue Lord, please forgive me, my religion's true I used to be the one they laughed at, no, they didn't take me serious. They didn't take me serious. Do I stand a chance now? Bitches who would diss me so curious. I bet that they got shit. And they looking like, why he so serious? I bet you a toe. Cause it took me this long to get here, pussy nigga, I'm furious. Yeah. I want the underdog, but y'all don't want to talk. Yeah. Boy, I got the juice in my city like pop. Yeah. I bring out the real niggas, bodies and thoughts. With a yeah. line down the block, my name yeah. fell up the lot. I used to wear all my uncle's jeans Until I became a designer fame Trap introduced me to finer things No deep when I sleep I had all I ever wanted Was a knife to my rubber band pop All I ever wanted was a knife to my rubber band pop All I ever wanted was a knife my rubber band pop All I ever wanted was a knife my rubber band pop For that bread I go I was, I was about to try to hit that cuckoo, but I ain't going to do that to y'all. <laughs> That's why I hit it. <laughs> See, cuckoo. there you go. I don't, hey, hey, I don't got the auto-tune. Nigga, I, don't, I, don't need, yeah. I don't need the auto-tune. For that bit, I go, cuckoo. 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 <laughs> I don't need the auto-tune. I'm good. I'm good just like I that. See. You know what I I'm saying? Look, I need man, auto-tune and tune auto <laughs> Since I've been rapping, need to be. I've been rapping for some years, man. I have never, not once, used auto tune because I, it's natural to me. You know what I'm saying? I naturally you have got this, natural this, this, auto tune. I don't need no tone adjustments with my voice. My voice is a nat- I'm a natural tenor. You understand what I'm saying? Natural. This shit's real over I, here. I feel you. Real. But I ain't knocking the ones that I need a little you. help. I ain't knocking them. If you need a little help with your vocals. And you know, do your thing. But Get me personally, shit. I don't need Get that shit. I'm gonna hit for that play I go Woo Cuckoo. <laughs> I don't I don't need I just sound just like how that nigga sound on the track. <laughs> sound just like how you sound on the track. I need to be I just happen to be scrolling through my social media too. I'm gonna have to be scrolling through my social media, man, and um, I just gotta give a, a little disclaimer with the uh, the chicks out here that uh, putting up them videos with their um <clears throat> Well, everything is out. You know what I'm saying? What? Look, the everything out. Titties, ass, bathing suit. You know what I'm saying? Showing all they, you know, everything. You feel me? I call those thirst traps. You know what I'm saying? They get, they get about <laughs> three, 400 likes, and they inbox be popping. Then they next message say this. I mean, they next status say this. Oh, I'm going to tell the niggas all in my inbox thirsty. Like, okay, why you post <laughs> up pictures of your ass out? I'm just wondering. Mm-hmm. Need a beat. Are you an ass out poster? Just be honest. No. You know the ass out poster? I do. I mean, in certain groups now. <laughs> like, in certain areas that it's, like, appropriate to post that stuff. I mean, post that stuff. And if they in your inbox shit, talk to them motherfuckers. I mean, what's the, what's the problem? Don't put it out there. 
that's it is what shit. it is. If you don't want that picture, when I put a picture up, I want people to say, "Damn!" I mean, that kind of picture you want somebody to show you. That's why the fuck I put the shit up. Stop playing. Stop lying to y'all. Stuff. I wish one of these hoes would screenshot me talking about how I want to put my face in their booty. 